How's it going everyone? Welcome to another episode. We're going to be doing a uh, quick video showing y'all how to put your numbers on your kayak once you get it registered and all that. Um, I want to go ahead and say that it didn't cost me all that much to get my kayak registered. It was about $65, but I paid an extra 20 bucks for a title. You don't have to title your hull, but they asked me if I wanted a title for it, and I went ahead and paid an extra 20 bucks for that. So it's really around 40, 45 bucks to get, uh, get everything done. And uh, I think that lasts for three years. So it's a pretty good price and it's pretty cheap. But anyways, I want to show y'all how to put the numbers on here. It, this works for boats, this works for kayaks, this probably works for just about any state. They all should be pretty close to the same. Anyways, let's jump into this and let's get it done. Okay, so let's talk real quick about the paperwork you get. I got this paperwork here uh, from the state of Louisiana Wildlife and Fisheries when I went and registered this kayak. It's got a bunch of information there at the top. But down here at the bottom, it kind of tells you uh, what you need to be doing. All right, so I want to talk real quick about the paperwork. This is the paper that I got from the Wildlife and Fisheries after I registered. It's got a bunch of my information up here at the top. And down here at the bottom, it kind of shows you um, where you need to be putting your numbers. It needs to be up here in the front of the hole. And it needs to be uh, this uh, going from this way, from left to right on one side and left to right on the other side also. And uh, they, they gave me these, these stickers here. So the stickers go on there after you put your letters. And then uh, the number that you're going to put on there is going to be up here at the top. It's going to be your registration number. So what you're looking for is a registration number. And that's the number that we're going to be putting on this kayak. And what, I wanted, what I'm going to do is I'm going to put it right here on this flat part of the kayak. I'm going to start probably about right here and put it across here. I, I don't want to put it too far up here because if you put it at an angle right here, it's not going to be able to see it from a distance. You want to be able, you want the game wardens to be able to see your numbers. So you need to put it on a flat part of it. So we're going to start the very first number right here and then go this way with it. So what I'm going to do is I'm, I've got these little Clorox wipes and we're going to wipe it down real quick with the Clorox and clean it. Make sure it's good and clean before we start uh, applying any letters to it. I don't really know how long these wipes are going to take. I mean, the, the liquid coming off these wipes is going to take the dry, so I went ahead and brought some, uh, I went ahead and brought some paper towels also. Look how dirty that was. It didn't even feel dirty or look dirty, but it was really nasty. So I'm glad I went ahead and cleaned it. And we're going to wipe it off real quick like that. All right, so these were the letters that I got. I found these where the, um, where the mailbox stuff is, if you go all the way back to the back of Walmart, uh, where they sell the, everything for uh, for your mailboxes and all that, they sell this right here, and it actually has a boat on there. So this is the exact size that you need. You just got to be at least three inches or bigger on the letters. The bigger your boat, the bigger letters, of course. But on the kayak, three inches should be good. This was less than two dollars. It was a dollar seventy-six or something like that for this whole pack, and it's got four of every letter and every number which is awesome so that you can use this on two different uh two different boats two different kayaks etc but this is what we're going to be putting on there so let me open this up and let's start applying them all right so the first letter we're going to need is an l i'm going to pull an l off of here i'm going to put it right here And then we need an A. These letters are kind of hard to work with because they're really, really soft. So what I'm doing is I'm starting, I'm starting the bottom to try to get it even with the, uh, the next letter over. And then I just, uh, I follow it up and then I follow it back down again so that it'll stay straight and follow it back up and back down. It's a little bit off so I'm going to pull it And then the last thing we got to put on there is a the little Louisiana thing. Um, I haven't eaten dinner. I got uh, pork chops and brown rice. And... 
You got the other switch in? Uh, yeah, but I'm still waiting on the wiring. I'm just doing a video showing how to put the, the numbers on there. And that right there is the finished product with the Louisiana sticker on there too. And what I want to do is I've got these GoPro stickers here. I don't have two of the same ones, which kind of sucks. But I'm going to go ahead and put this uh, this this GoPro sticker right here on the top. I'm going to put it right over here because I'll be using some GoPros. That's what I'm shooting with right now. I love GoPro. So let's see. Let's put it... Um, Let's just put it right here. And I got some other stickers and stuff from other brands of uh, different things that I like to uh, to use that I'm going to put on there too. So now we got the GoPro sticker on there. It's a little bit crooked, but whatever. All right, so what we need to do first is we need to put the, the Louisiana sticker on. And then we need to put an M on. And there we go. There's the other side done. I'm also going to go ahead and put a... Uh, I'm going to go ahead and put a GoPro sticker on this one too. That way we got a GoPro sticker on each side. And actually beside that one, I'm going to go ahead and put this little small one. There we go. <laughs> What I'm talking about and that's the finished product oh yeah it looks good well thank y'all so much for watching that pretty much ends this episode I hope you got something useful out of that if you did make sure you like the video get the video a thumbs up all that good stuff share it if you want to subscribe if you feel like it until next time everyone tight lines we'll see y'all in the next video